And in reference to the previous video, in reference to, uh, you know, the history of things, people got to advertise the facts. You know, the Treasury has to advertise it. And in reference to uh, somebody wanting to know about Vegas, what I, in, in reference to my mother and father's estates, what I own in Vegas, that has to be advertised. Even if law enforcement has to go to the news network and say, hey, what is going on? You have to advertise his identity. It is newsworthy. It's based on deeds department facts, copyrights, information. They have to go over to a news network and say, hey, it's a demand. The royal protocol in the media has been there the whole time, and it says that people are not allowed to block me and my identity from the media being advertised. Anybody's got something to say about it? It's court cases. It says in the Royal Protocol that if anybody tampers with my career or blocks me from being advertised of who I am and who my parents are, people have to get arrested. That's what it says. It says they do not have a right trying to overshadow my ownership with their popularity or their tricks or their Trojan horse tricks of people blocking my identity from the media blocking the royal protocol information of who I am and what I own in the media, it says on those documents. And the FCC knows that too. And the deeds department knows that. The treasury knows that. And anybody not complying with that information must be fired from their positions. And new people have to take position in offices that are refusing to advertise who I am and who my parents are. That's one of the reasons why the Royal Protocol is in the media. So they can't steal my identity. So they can't steal my mother and father's estates. So they can't deprive me of my rights of what I'm the owner of. And what my parents gave to me. And my trust funds. And revenues. And dividends. No matter who they think they are. That's, why it's, that's one of the reasons why it's there. And it's there forever. Of who I am and... You know, impeaching people, arresting people, if that's what needs to be done, then that's what is going to have to be done. I'm the owner of my mother and father's estates. All these clowns that tried to make up their lies and falsely associated themselves with my mother and father's estates that are trying to steal, you know, whoever these people are, they need to go to court. It's never signed, never, never, gave, never, never, sold, never. No matter what fake audios they ever made, no matter what forgeries or fake documents they ever wrote, the Royal Protocol in the media says I'm the owner forever. No matter what forgeries, no matter what anybody says, it has to be advertised. And they can fire news network people. They can fire people in, uh, in the media that are refusing to go public with the information of who I am and who my parents are. And what I'm the owner of in the media. And in reference to people downgrading or slandering my character. Or people trying to steal scholarships that I was supposed to have received from universities. People need to go to court. The postal thieves, the dirty government intercepting or stealing monies or checks or credit cards that I was supposed to have received. Or benefits. People need to go to court. That's the facts of the due process and the evidence of people that have stolen from me, people that have accusated against my identity, people that have ac accusated against the missile in my mouth, the people that accusated against my athletic ability, people trying to slander my uh, my health, or these people tried to beat me up with satellites all the time. They damaged my teeth trying to make up lies because my teeth was prettier than theirs because I took better care of my teeth than they did. My teeth are documented. Any damage is lawsuits. Any attempts, even the smallest damage, is lawsuits. See, the Royal Protocol is a documentation of my identity. And my teeth are all documented in the Royal Protocol. Of my identity and who my parents are. And these people thought they would try to play their, their tagging game. Like they were trying to put their stink on somebody else's teeth. Or trying to put their markings or graffiti on somebody else's body. Those people need to go to court. Every person that tried to damage any part of my teeth or damaged any part of my anatomy 
has to go to court. And it has to be recorded on video in those court cases. Every court case has to be recorded on video. And nothing's ever, nothing's ever handled out of court. Everything is handled in court. Some people might get sued for something small. Some people might, you know, there might be uh, some particular leeway on some things. But in reference to lots of other things, things there is not going to be any leeway in reference to some things. Meaning, you know, some of these people might ask for plea bargains. But they cannot, you know, I'm not sure what the... Uh, what their requests are in reference to their plea bargains, but in reference to my teeth and face, that's one of the main issues. And these people trying to steal from my penis, or these people trying to damage my face and teeth. Now, there's some, they got to leave things alone. And if they stole any penis size, they get arrested. If they stole blood or sperm, there's going to be court cases. If people damaged my teeth, there's got to be court cases. And I'm supposed to receive money from the treasury and the courts and other companies and businesses that I'm supposed to receive monies. And I'm supposed to be on the payroll of all my mother and father's companies forever. And I'm the owner forever. So in reference to people stealing the postal mail or people trying to play tricks, there has to be court cases.